The Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment has taken steps towards improving targeting, reach and coverage for social assistance programs to persons who are vulnerable and or living in poverty. Efforts have been made to expand the coverage of the Public Assistance Program PAP Cash Transfer Grant by increasing the number of beneficiaries from 2,600 to 3,600 since 2020. The Ministry has also adopted the National Social Protection Policy 2022 to 2030, which aims to strengthen the social protection services in St. Lucia with the theme Delivering Care, Assuring Dignity, Building Resilience. The NSPP 2022-2030 to promotes the life cycle approach to social protection. This means persons of all ages are targeted for benefits. In the face of scarcity, it is important that targeting is effective and that the most vulnerable and most in need are served. The Feedback Redress Mechanism, FRM, for social assistance programs have been developed to gauge the effectiveness of targeting by providing an avenue for persons to provide feedback or submit complaints when the system fails to serve them or others as intended. Feedback can also help those in authority improve targeting or redirect resources where needed. The FRM will allow for feedback and complaints from all persons served by social assistance programs from social sector ministries such as the Ministry of Equity, the St. Lucia Social Development Fund, the SSDF, the Ministry of Health, and the Ministry of Education. To submit feedback or a complaint, access the form from a caseworker or someone from an outreach office or via the Ministry of Equity's Facebook page. Complete the form and submit. Await feedback from the Ministry of Equity. You will receive notice that your form was received. You will also be invited to discuss your complaint and some form of redress will be presented to you. The Ministry of Equity assures you that your concerns will be heard. For those who may choose to access the form virtually, go to the Ministry's Facebook page. Search the FRM form, click on the link, complete the form and click Submit. If you still have concerns, use a trusted advisor to complete the form on your behalf.